Another hitting skill that requires a lot of practice is bunning. The effort is worth it because the difference in many games is just one run. And many times that one run comes when one team advances a runner with a bunt. Bobby, come over here and explain the sacrifice bunt. We'll use a pivot method. Using the pivot method, I set myself in my regular batting stance. As the pitcher winds up, I pivot around on the balls of my feet, like this, so my toes on both feet are pointed at the pitcher. I make sure to keep my weight forward and my knees bent. I slide my top hand halfway up the barrel of the bat, and I hold it firmly in my fingers out in front of the plate. I keep my head low and look just over the bat, which I hold right at the top of the strike zone. I keep my eyes on the ball and watch it until it hits the bat. If the pitch is above the bat, I know it's a ball, and I don't punt. I try to catch the ball with the bat. On low pitches, I bend my knees and bring my whole body down with the bat to the level of the ball. So I'm always looking at the ball right over the bat. And of course, you want to hit the top of the ball with the bottom of the bat. Yeah. A pop-up on a bun is almost always a double play. OK, Bobby, show us how it's done. Right down the pipe, Justin. Good. You should never bunt a pitch that's out of the strike zone. Prove it, Justin. Great fun, great fun. It's beautiful to see it done right. 